morning. Good morning. It's bright and early at 5 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday. And I am looking at 65, chance of 95 today. And there is a um, trend going around that I needed to speak on. I'm part of that trend. It's a pretty, it's a good sized blanket. I'll say it that way. And if I had a kid throwing a temper tantrum to show as an example, it might actually be better, but I don't. Okay, so I tried to do it the best I can. If you show a person a situation that, and I'll, and I'll bring it out like Trump, or it can go with global climate change and stuff like that. If you show a person the reality of a situation and it's done, not only fair and square, but it's it's there for anybody to see, you know, the numbers don't lie type thing. And that person is not able to see through their own delusion. That person is not able to clearly look through the, and I'll say it, through their own delusion at the reality of it. And they can't see it. There's two choices. They are either clinical and that and that's a possibility that you really can't, that they just can't see it. It doesn't mean that the truth isn't there. It means that they're clinical, that they truly can't see it. For whatever reason. Could be dementia, could be, you know, uh, mental capacity. It's a mental capacity situation. But there is, that's clinical. Or... If they are not capable or willing to see do that for the second reason of their own desires, their own ulterior motive, their hidden agenda, and they're willing to put up that kind of a fight or throw that kind of temper tantrum and I'll say it this way, that it's diabolical. Meaning you are trying to subvert a situation. You're trying to, to get under it. Technically it's evil. You are trying to manipulate it every, uh, to your last degree. Even though it is a truth, even though it's the right, even though you are in the wrong. Okay? And I'll say, you can go on global climate change. It's, it's, it's here. Anybody who wants to look at the planet, um, you can't help but notice it. Those that would say no, um, they they are they fall under those categories. The situation with the 2020 election, same scenario. 
came. That's all I really have to say. And that's all anybody should have had to say. Because you had a host of people that knew. We've hey, Look, we've done the, this election stuff a few hundred times. Okay. It's not, it's not that hard to figure out. And yet, you had a whole bunch of people that weren't willing to say anything. They said it behind closed doors. Away from him. They tried to tell him. But they should have. Wow. They should have buckled down and said it outright to the public. They should have said it outright that there was a problem and it wouldn't have gotten this far. <clears throat> That's all I have to say. That's all anybody should have had to say back then. That's all that we need to say now. Get ready, it's going to always happen. This is why you call call out something on the spot. For what it is. And... All it is is a corrective action. That's all it really is. It's a corrective action. To make a place a better world. To stop a person from <clears throat> doing damage to themselves or others around them. Okay. That's all it is. And like that spoiled child, bringing it back full circle, like that spoiled child, you can either let them throw their temper tantrum or you can do a corrective action on them. And that's normally a swat on the butt or something like that, but whatever it may be. And they need to understand that there is consequences for that action. Okay. That's all. A mellow, kind of meaty uh, morning talk. And I haven't even had coffee yet. Good morning, though. Nothing but love for everyone. And uh, God help us. Have a great, great day. No matter when you hear this.